Three years after their original ScanWatch, Withings has introduced the new series, which is the ScanWatch 2 and the ScanWatch Lite. The ScanWatch 2 is their flagship wearable. It's designed to pack all of the temperature sensors, heart rate tracking, everything you could possibly want. So it does cost a bit more. ScanWatch Lite is Withings' attempt to get those people who are kind of just starting their health tracking journey and are just like, yeah, give me the heart rate, give me the sleep tracking, but they don't need like SpO2 or heart rate variability. In the process, they save themselves about a hundred bucks. The Withings ScanWatch 2 and the ScanWatch Lite are really for the people who don't care about having like a touch screen or being able to respond to their notifications right on their smartwatch. Um, both watches use a small 0.63 inch grayscale OLED display. So you'll see like your heart rate, you'll be able to like, read your notifications as they scroll across, but you can't type, there's no touch screen. Everything is just done with the crown push the crown, you can scroll the crown, and then you'll ultimately have to pull out your phone for basically everything else. Withings also has a HealthMate app, which it uses, it feels a lot like Google Fit, where it'll give you a daily report that gives you how you slept, how your heart rate was overnight, but then it stacks up a bunch of little cards for your heart rate in the moment. They're gonna bring out updates for your post-workout recovery time. So it'll give you like, if you run for an hour, they'll have a future update to say like, you need to rest for this many hours before you're ready to get back out. The HealthMate app really just gives you all of the information you want as far as your sleep for the night, if you were in REM sleep for too long, if you were in deep sleep for just enough time, um, just to make up for the fact that you really don't have that display on the watch. So the Withing ScanWatch 2 ships out at 349. The ScanWatch Lite ships out at 249. If you're looking for something to compare to, you're probably looking at other hybrid models. So there's like the Fossil Gen 6 Wellness Hybrid Edition, which takes the same kind of grayscale display, but it's not quite as premium. Like it skips the stainless steel case, stips, it skips the sapphire glass display, and then out Outside of that, you're really looking at one of Garmin's more affordable models. So if you wanna grab the Venue, which is kind of a lifestyle focused smartwatch, or if you wanna to head to like an older Apple watch or maybe an older Galaxy watch, where you are getting a touch screen, you are getting a little more app integration, but it's probably the best way to save yourself some money because in the grand scheme of things, the Withings ScanWatch 2 and ScanWatch Lite are pretty well affordable. So one of the most important things with ScanWatch 2 is Withings is putting a much greater emphasis on women's health, offering in-depth cycle tracking where you can log your symptoms right on the watch. It's one of the things you can do with the small display. The ScanWatch 2 also has 24 seven temperature monitoring through Withings TempTech 24 seven new sensor. And that measures both your skin temperature and the ambient sensor to kind of help gauge, like give you an estimate of when it thinks you might be getting sick or if you might be pushing yourself a little too hard. During our time with the device, Withings told us that users can expect about 30 days of battery life. So you top it up at the start of the month. And then if you're gone for a weekend away, really don't have to bring a cable with you. And it doesn't take a proprietary cable. As long as you pop it on a wireless charger, you should be good to go after about two hours. In a sea full of smartwatches that seem like they're just getting smarter, the Withings ScanWatch 2 is a great option if you want something with a little more everyday style, but a few of the health tracking features you might not want to live without. So if you want to read more about it and see what we compare it to, check the link in the description.